Hakuna cha sublime no hapa sio kwa particular what you wish you want is what we are kila mara kushock the culture jadisha deep you want how sick you want ni aje sana kwa sana album reviews karibu sana kwa another album review if you are a returning subscriber shukran sana for being here and for the continued support na kama ni mara yako ya kwanza karibu sana sana to the channel kuna this and many more other videos unaweza check out but shukran kwa kuwa hapa na for wanting to check this video out hope mtaku have at the end of the video na uniambie maoni yako kuhusu what we are here to do leo ni day 19 of the music writer exercise aka mwe a concept ilianzishwa in 2015 by an american music critic anaitwa Gary Suarez the idea ni kila siku of february skiza an album hujawahi skiza before kisha andika a tweet about it ni fanya tangu 2019 huni mwaka wangu wa nne kuifanya kuanzia last year 2021 nilianza kufanya first listen reviews of killer project that ndaskiza for the entire month and then later I'll do my tweet reviews so this year I fanya the same thing as I've mentioned learn the day 19 of this exercise saini 522 2022 at least the mail line as compared to video ya jana jana ni disc is a mortal soul if you're into kenyan rock kenyan metal that's a video for you that's why tuko hapa na that's the exercise nimekuwa nikifanya huu mwezi kuna other videos before this after this iwapo ni kitu uko interested in checking out na usikize views zangu on different albums hii wiki nimekuwa nikifanya rock na metal bands rock na metal albums na napenda disclaimer nimekuwa nikisahau kuisema nikianza leo nimekumbuka i am not a kenyan rock or a kenyan metal pundit for that you need disclaimer for the sake of my reputation you need some bit unqualified bit unverifiable niko na an excuse niko na a reason in fact see excuse so as the video title inasema let's get to it tuko hapa kuzungumzia only a few survivors debut album ya rush uh, swahili rock band he will release back in 2016 september tukifanya guys reviews our criteria who wanna aspect start to production and musicality concept na idea and the content and the themes of a project only a few survivors ni a consistent high energy album with stellar arrangements beautiful compositions stacked and the energy in a carry through all the entire album from one song to the other band yenyewe they don't let up our toy their foot on the pedal song after another idea after another wakijaribu ku string together ideas that zina flow kuanzia mwanzo hadi mwisho although hakuna a unifying narrative that they are tying in with the songs but unaweza tell that kuna your attempt ya kujaribu ku flow kuanzia song till the next kama ni kukuwa na terms that call back to a previous songs ama ideas in azo flow into one another as the sequence in a go hiyo ndio kile wana attempt kutimiza through the musicality and the compositions as well as the vocalist who takes us through the different stories the high energy na high intensity that ni mention earlier the album hayanzi hivyo inaanza na a trick that you may find interesting jinanza na a piano centered piece kuna a chord progression that sustains the entire song played in an open manner kisha kuna a melody that tunasikia layered on top of that na the entire song kuna a piano layers but it's still open and rhythmical then as the song in a progress kuna energy shift kidogo kuna further instrumentation added but that is brief then tunamaliza na a piano melody immediately imeisha nimeka nikajiuliza what was that for what was the prelude for lo and behold wameniambia in your face with what they did next you the following song animal man <laughs> ni haunting na inaanza na hiyo melody nimesikia kimaliza ina open with a distorted riff that plays that same melody although imekuwa fastened ilikuwa right in my face wananiambia oh utajua ujui swali muuliza 
ngoja tu in the blink of an eye wakanipatia jawabu and that sort of intensity key emotion in the arrangements and how the entire song in a feel very meticulously done the movement from the vocalist to the instrumentation instrumentation to the vocalist key arrangement in the feel all of these songs zimefanywa in a stellar manner kuna deliberateness kuna sophistication that makes these pieces highly captivating na animal man ndio mwanzo wa this journey thematically in a bring in social na political themes concept here the environment shaping na informing one's actions na trajectory of life and that ties in to msafiri ndio maana liko nasema hakuna a unifying narrative but kuna those maybe tropes and ideas and words that zitafanya a call back to a previous song as well as the overall atmosphere of a song kama ni the darker more haunting and reflective themes na atmospheres ngoma kama animal man building after that kwa msafiri idea ya kutaka ku escape na they even mention that kwa the song then kuna idea kutaka kurudi so kuna a trope ya a journey na movement then be a party one of these fun songs called the album it's even brief but in a change energy kidogo in terms of how it feels generally as compared to the previous two songs ki intensity lakini pia ki maudhui kuna that diversity na playfulness both musically na thematically songs such as be a party that you mention ukifikiria night in the bar it also refers to the same not as fun overall lakini the concept itself ya being at the bar and night in the bar ina encapsulate the same lakini hiyo ngoma ukiangalia kuna other activities that is in a happen kwa the story and some of these songs are story and narrative driven something that they use in their technique na the flow of the album but the song in itself kuna things that are happening that are not overall fun ama generally entertaining but the song in itself setting yake manages to touch upon the same jukuna concept ya drinking and mtu kukua out of senses zake kutojua kile kinaendelea and the like now those lighter songs also include kitu ka dream chaser the title ni self explanatory interestingly while nilikuwa nafikiria kuhusu the flow and the sequencing of the album i thought perhaps the reason wali include be a party the mara kwanza nilikuwa na feel ni unnecessary and a filler track was for the sake of the reference kwa dream chaser i think the lead vocalist ali mentioned she cannot stop me na the concept ya mtu kufuata ndoto zake so sijui if that's the reason wali incorporate the song ya be a party sijui kuna meeting someone kwa the be a party but dream chaser is the kind of lighter songs that ni me mentions ikona yes personal lakini as well as being a general idea attached to the concept lakini ile intensity kwa the instrumentation inabaki kuwa ile ile ni vile tu mood na maudhui zimebadilika on top of that ngoma kama pasala bien which is now more of she came to mean addressing beauty um to relationship centered and it changes another energy shift moment kwa the album the tone ju it's a blues rock song na inaanza with that acoustic blues after verse ya kwanza energy na pick up na tunarudi back to the heavy distorted riffs and the bass lines na lead guitar lines that accompany the verse that are prominent for the entire album but as a blues rock song it's an unexpected beautiful surprise na change the song before that ni let it be rock as its title inaweza kupatia a hint ya where wanaelekea with the song kuna idea of the music let it be rock kuna idea ya let it rock kuna idea ya let it be so facing a challenging situation facing an unexpected circumstance my shining achana nayo acha yende let it be let it rock na the music emphasizing the entire idea and the verses are short then kuna the chorus segments and the musicality overflowing keep you in the find pia interesting in their style how playful they are 
with the arrangements ikikuja kwa the songwriting how they play in a space night in the rock bunny a song that does that ilikuwa refreshing kusikia another playful aspect was the delivery kwa the closing song sons of robots one of the lead singles versus piano fupi lakini besides that delivery of vocalist anatumia a talking kind of approach then i will sprinkle a dramatization part of the musicality peer in you know, include apart from sisi who focus on the main vocals kwa the verses ama the choruses kuna a number of songs zile zime include harmonies kama ni kwa verse harmonies kadha ama kwa choruses kupatia the songs more oomph na texture especially songs that include other vocalists laying the harmonies kuna that different feeling kitu refreshing and a new layer to the songs nilikuwa na gusia flow so you have songs such as darkness and witchcraft bringing in stories za watu wenye unajua kukuwa adui wako na watu kukuwa against your plans and the next after that you see kumbaya so idea ya darkness literally ina come up kwa the following song and tying into songs that fit that aesthetic kama animal man na msafiri another song that ina fit that sort of atmosphere ni sons of robots that closes lakini this one now speaks about the society na our addiction to technology then kuna tamadunga leather jackets black leather jackets wakijaribu ku save the society na ku break gadgets but that's the overall idea of the song kitu nilikuwa nafikiria by repeating the chorus at the end of the song sijui if ina kuacha na a resolution despite move walikuwa wamesema ya ku crash gadgets imenikumbusha feature ya all of these songs they all end na climatic endings then zinamaliza in a sort of performance kind of way but also kufanya what a song should be doing ikikamilisha kuacha na a moment of silence na a moment ya ku pause kidogo before transitioning to the next song but hiyo moment ya ku climax na kushuka then kuacha maybe an instrumental it reverberate itakuwa a bass line that could be a riff imemaliza ku play unasikia the last chord ama the last note hiyo technique ni kitu wanatumia through the entire album so the high quality of the compositions ni consistent the high quality ya yeah, the delivery of the songs kuna an intention that unaweza pick kwa the flow lakini hakuna a unifying story that tuna follow itafanya pia ni mention ukisikia sons of robots na hapo ndo tunatoa concept ya only a few survivors while the rest of society imemezo na teknolojia hiyo idea ya only a few survivors if you are picking that as i constantly say as the foundation ya the story ya the album the foundation ya the concept of the album seek to that we center on kwa the previous songs up until this point that tunapata oh so ilikuwa idea kuhusu technology also ndio maana kuna only a few survivors seek to na come up but ni kwa nafikiria these individuals that stories out zinakuwa told kama ni kwa night in the rock bar ama msafiri na animal man and implications za stories zao hinting upon the concept ya only a few survivors generally but to consider the closing song that isn't necessarily the case which brings me to my other point the clarity and the instrumentation utasikia the driving bass lines the drum work the distorted electronic riffs the lead mwenye kwa na number of solos then the vocalist pia vocal zake ni clean kitu that ilikuwa off in some instances ina involve the vocalist kuna moments where the stories has come out clear kwa sababu ya enunciation hii na happen na the verses in english ju when ni kiswahili kuna more clarity apart from that kuna two instances where vocal zake zimekuwa mixed differently from how zimekuwa handled kwa the rest of the album ilianza kwa darkness and witchcraft then i believe kwa usiku mbaya ama let it be rock then pasalabian something that happens after the acoustic blues segment when the other instruments zina come in they seem to drown the vocalist something that inani bring to the other point kuna few instances 
that the vocals zingekuwa more prominent kidogo tu in terms of the levels niliongelea inclusion ya other vocalists na harmonies kulikuwa na chance pia kwa sons of robots as well as kwa another song mwanzo wa album sikumbuki ilikuwa gani na i bring up due to inclusion kwa sons of robots ili sound more reverbed na echoey i could transfer your feeling ya yeah, the song as compared to when the same same technique ya kuchant ilitumika kwa an earlier song lakini ya patron is concerns na raise the musicality the compositions the arrangements are constantly stellar they deliver from song after another it's an electrifying album that nahisi this is one of kenyan rock's staple album an engaging a solid debut for rush lakini for the overall scene na pia kenyan music generally in album that ime make a statement sijui ripples ili cause ama impact ili kwa nayo time ili toka but listening to the musicality the production na he see it is one of those albums that zita go down in history as an important album for its genre lakini pia outside of that sasa cha nitafute band camp ni new album sijui kama maiski za only a few survivors by rush if you have niambie kwa comment section if you are this fine to the review I believe you have a love ningependa sana kukuona kwa any other video under MWE shukran sana for your time